What's up YouTube family? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. And today we have another wedding gig vlog. Today I'm in Azo, Texas. I'm DJing Julie and Chase's wedding. It's gonna be a fun one, hopefully. Uh, with that being said, you know, make sure to subscribe. Make sure to hit the like button. You know, make sure to share the video. I've been getting like 20 views in the last like four or five videos that I've done. So it's kind of hard to keep up the vlogs going when no one is actually watching them. So if you can support me and just, you know, share that video and hit the like and subscribe. With that being said, I brought out everything today, even the sub it's right there. Everything here is very tight. Like it's, it's crazy. I need, I need to get a, a bigger car. So let's do the unloading. I'm not sure where I'm gonna go. I see some areas here, but this is the vendor parking. So hopefully um, I'm pretty close to where I need to go. I'm in charge of the ceremony, cocktail hour, and the reception. So I'm doing everything. Um, so let's get started. Here we go. All right, so we got a quick breakdown. We have the facade from Rockville. We have the two tops, which are JBL, not JBL, JBL Eons, uh, 15 inch. Then we have uh, the 15 inch or 18, I'm not sure, subwoofer uh, from Harrisburg. Uh, let's continue. And we'll then continue on with the dance floor lighting, which I have the Swarm FX5. Pretty good lighting source there for your uh, your dance floor all right so we have the pioneer sb3 we have the ranger mixer and then we have the shore blx uh multi-pack wireless microphones video right there I want to mention something throughout the night the coordinator provided me with a timeline that did not have time by that I mean she had everything written down you know like the first dance introductions father daughter mother son all of those good things right were written down in the timeline but she never specified at what time we were gonna do things so throughout the night, it was a lot of me trying to look for the coordinator when I need to get on the mic or when I needed to say something to the guests of what's coming next. That was a big issue. I found myself struggling and everything felt like it was on the fly. It felt like it wasn't actually prepared and it was, it was just a struggle. With that being said, I stopped the video right now just because as you can see there is a lot of people on the dance floor dancing to country now the bride did send me a must playlist and it was a lot of country songs and when i started playing the country songs which she specified on the must playlist the groom at this time came up to me which you don't see just because the camera right now is just focusing on the dance floor but the groom is actually talking to me right now telling me that he didn't want the country music or didn't want me to slow down the pace with the music which at that time I went ahead and let him know hey this is this song actually is on the must playlist and on top of that I, I even told them there's like three or four more songs that are slow that are country 
that I have to play. It's on the must playlist. And when I said that, he didn't know what I was talking about. And that's when I realized that he didn't have clue or he didn't have any clue of what the bride sent to me. And most likely he didn't even know there was a must playlist. So yeah, the, the communication for this event or for this wedding was was pretty bad it, it was it was it was bad we we had a good time but at the same time i was stressing out but uh but yeah that's how my night went and that was pretty much the last song slow song that i actually played just because the groom was like you know he didn't want me to slow the pace down but the bride then came up to me and asked for a country song and it was like a big back and forth. It was terrible. Just terrible. But let's continue on. Thank you so much for watching make sure to hit the like button make sure to subscribe and make sure to write a comment below and let me know what y'all think and thank you once again and have a blessed day until next time